as a matter of fact, for people who are interested in, in the character, they've learned a lot through this second film. The, the role I play uh, of the blind man has been living in um, seclusion for some time, and he is raising a young uh, daughter, and uh, their life gets uh, shattered by the uh, intrusion of some really nefarious characters, and uh, chaos ensues. Shadow! In a sense, I was surprised because I think it's a surprising story. Uh, and, but, but, but in a sense, I was not surprised because I expected no less from uh, the imaginations of uh, Fede Alvarez and Rodas Sahagas that they would come up with a story that not only reflected uh, accurately the, the world that they created in Don't, the original Don't Breed, but that actually went further and um, kind of enhanced that world and, and pushed the envelope of the world a bit, which I think that they, do, they did in the script of this. So I was delighted and, uh, uh, and surprised, yes. If he appears to be immortal in the first film, it would be because he's, he's, he's he's really within the confines of his own kingdom where he does, he really does have a tremendous amount of power. Of course, in the second film that, that changes also, he is older during this his film and he has been through, he's been through the events of the first film, which, you know, left him weakened, I think. Uh, so the approach to this was um, really just to make myself as, uh, as strong as I possibly could, given the circumstances of his life, to understand that he is um, still going to be uh, formidable, uh, that he is still going to do everything that's necessary to survive, and to understand that because of the character of Phoenix, he really at this point does have something to live for. He va venir me chercher. À présent, vous allez voir ce que je vois. When asked about God being good or bad, he says that God is fair. And I think that, that that's kind of a key thing to him. It really has less to do with happiness or fulfillment or uh, any kind of joy than it has to do with achieving some kind of understanding, some kind of uh, arriving at a relationship, some kind of an equilibrium with his own life which has been off the rails for, for a long, 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 long time as he's tried to right his ship, as he's tried to come to terms with uh, some of his own, um, with what has been visited upon him and with his own response to some of the ills that have happened to him. Mm -hmm. You know, he is not, he is not a, He's not a passive character. Uh, when pushed, he pushes back hard. Tu as échoué, c'est moi qui ai l'arme. Pardon, la prochaine fois j'y arriverai. T'as failli m'avoir, hein, mon chien. 